primarily we sell our soap um, online and then we're focusing this year on um, holiday markets, more, more bang for our buck. So. is a more informed goat keeper takes better care of their animals. That animal is going to have a happier, healthier life. And that's going to be a win for the owner too, because they aren't dealing with um, uh, you know, a sick animal and things like that. So. But it's, it's interesting because there's nobody right now like working on this next generation. Um, but that said, this goats are exploding in popularity. And um, this breed in particular is exploding popularity. So um, there's definitely a, an interest and a desire and um, there is, you know, I definitely believe that we need to continue to teach kids um, about these animals, not just cows, not just the pigs are huge in 4-H. Um, and the, the difference too with 4-H and these is that it's a year round commitment for them. They don't just get to raise them up, sell them at market and then go on vacation. So um, it's a very different story. Um. And this is Nigerian dwarf milk is the highest in butter fat, so um, it is it doesn't taste like goat. And so a Nigerian dwarf is uh, typically a quart of milk a day is considered a standard production, and I expect at least double that from my girls. So.